Big changes in Fort Hood leadership as 1st Cavalry Division Commander Major General Paul Calvert relinquishes his role. We learn more about the future on post. Maggie Lowe Miller has the story. I think this is absolutely the most ready division that our Army has. Um, and there is not a single mission that we are not capable of winning at. An end of an era on Fort Hood. 1st Cavalry Division Commander Major General Paul Calvert is handing over the reins. There are some tremendous team players that are on this installation that enable our mission every single day. As he says farewell, he reflects on his tenure. My first year here, I had the opportunity to be the uh, Deputy Commanding General for the division and was deployed with the division headquarters over to Afghanistan for uh, one year. What he treasures most about his time on post? The people. One, because they volunteered to serve. Two, because you see the commitment when you look them in the eyes and you have a conversation that they believe in what they're doing. Moving into the position is Major General Jeffrey Broadwater. I would tell you if I had the opportunity to pick my replacement, he would be first and foremost on my list. Major General Calvert says he has what it takes to lead the division into the future. He's a wonderful person. He's got a great sense of humor. Uh, he's got great intellect. And uh, most importantly, I think he's got great demeanor and great temperament. On Fort Hood, Maggie Lomiller, 25 News. A ceremony for the change of command is scheduled for next Thursday.